Well, good afternoon and welcome to the Akunalufti Mountain Farm Museum here at the base of the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. See behind us we've got a place, it's part of the farm, it's the old farmland. Actually right over here we've got an old outhouse. <clears throat> Not sure if you're supposed to use it, but you could. Another thing out in this neat field is, look at this elk. There is a ton of elk out here. Look at that, just hanging out in the old field, just doing their thing. This is probably the, it's definitely the first time we've seen elk out in the field like that. Like as many as this, all out there, they're enjoying the beautiful sunshine because look, it is a beautiful day out here. So I don't blame them. Wow, look at those leaves on the tree there. Did you see that? That crazy squirrel. I mean, he's not crazy, I guess. That's, he's doing what he's doing. He's just getting some food, but better not stand under that. See, look, there he's got one. Oh, he's taking it back up. Look at that. That's a smitty, breath of the smitty. That's a pretty smart animal. Huh. I wonder what else we can find over here. So yeah, you know, it's a mountain farm. The old mountain farmstead, just like they did back in the old days. Why don't we just kind of walk around and look at some things? Sounds pretty all right. Oh, look, I got the old woodshed here for chopping some wood. That's a lot of wood to chop. Somebody's got a job ahead of them. But if that's what you're relying on to, you know, heat a place like this, it's probably worth it. And then back here, way in the corner, Yep, that's where we keep the outhouse. It's a long walk, but it might smell, so we keep it away. I don't know where that squirrel's at, but he's still up there. He's still up there somewhere, because I just saw a bunch of those apple-y looking thing. I don't think they're apples, but but yeah, I, I don't know where he's at. He's up there. He's got a good bit to eat for a while. Ooh, look, can you see? I don't, that's not the squirrel, but can you see those things? I don't know. I can't tell if it's focusing on them or not, but that's what he's dropping. Yeah, I'm not getting too close. I don't want to get knocked in the head. We just learned a little something. They're horns, right? The elk's horns. They shed them every year, but if they get too big, they actually take them off manually. They'll saw them off. I mean, you know, they'll humanely they'll do it because there's a lot of people around here and cars. They get a little too close, and their horns are too big, and they start busting windows out. So I'll tell you what, those elk are no joke. There is a ton of them out there. I don't even. You probably can't see them. Got this wide angle lens on there, so I can't really zoom in too, too much, but those elk are no joke. Okay. Hey. Gonna go in? Oh, nope. Just, okay. I'm just taking a shot of the door here. Thank you, though. Visitors are welcome. I was just greeted in there, although I'm not going in, but the elk are not. So we'll keep them elk back in the field here so we can stay safe. Golly, there's so many of them. I can't believe it still. How many elk there are. Sheesh. Whoa, look at that squirrel. Not just the squirrel, look at the elk. Holy moly. He's right out there. That looks like a dude that you don't want to mess with right there. Holy moly. Get the heck out of here. Oh, look out, squirrel.
Too close for comfort. Well, I'd say that uh, a few, few hundred pounds gives him the right away. We're going the opposite way. Sometimes it doesn't go as quite. Oh, you know what? I just remembered that crazy squirrel. Well, I think that's enough of that excitement. I, I think he went across the river. There's a little tiny river right across the way. And I think he went over there, so it's pretty safe. So let's. Let's go look at some more things around here. It's a pretty big open field here, and look at that neat barn. That's pretty cool. Why don't we go over there? What do you think, guys? Should we go over there? You know what? I, I know the answer already. <laughs> we're, we're, we're going over there. Just keep in mind, if you are coming out here to the Akunalufti Mountain Farm Museum, it's a real place out in the real woods, in the real mountains, with real animals out here that you need to be watching out for. Like gnats, and elk, squirrels, sometimes chickens, I think, but none today. Let's go in the shade. Yeah, it's bright. Hmm. That squirrel's pretty cool, but look. Ooh, the notorious Bob. Bob. Look here, see, if you don't know who Bob is, you probably do, but you don't know that you do. But Bob, he would visit all these places and put his name all over everything. So you knew he was there. Bob, he was here, Bob was here. Bob got a ticket, paid a hundred dollar fine. Moral of the story, don't go writing on old buildings. It's not cool. Whoa, look in here, it's like the stables. Oh yeah, it's like horse stables, I guess. Oh, here's some that are open. Anybody in here? Oh, Look at here, we're in the stables. How neat is this? This is this is where the horses did their thing. They drank and eat and went to the bathroom. Let's get out. Oh. Here are some tools. That's pretty neat. I guess that's what they use. On the horses. Oh, look at this. Looks like a big mustache. What? Huh. And a little mustache. Oh, look at these really cool wagons here. Look at this green and red. That's Christmas. It's definitely a Christmas wagon. Because anything green and red means Christmas. Whoa. Did you guys see that crazy squirrel? Am I got? Am I zoomed out in? Oh, it about killed me. Like I said, you got to watch out for those guys too. But man, look at this beautiful place. It is. It's pretty all right here. It's just fun. Just to, I think sometimes they even do like, I don't know. They have people out here showing you how to work the old tools and teaching you a little bit about all the stuff. Maybe a little bit how to talk, so you don't go meow, 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 meow. Maybe, hopefully, I could use the help. One thing though, is that it's really pretty out here. That's why we love the mountains. Super pretty. But anyways, I think I'm being summoned. That it's time to go. Man, look at that! I'll never get old of seeing stuff like that. It is time for us to go. So hopefully you enjoyed 
walking around the old Akunalufti Mountain Farm Museum. There's definitely more to see than just this stuff. We saw some crazy elk do some crazy stuff. And that was crazy. But anyways, they're still out there. I don't think you're really supposed to go to the fields. Did you hear that? They sound so crazy. Anyways. See you guys in the next one. As far as we're concerned. Yeah. That's pretty cool. <laughs>